Hey everybody, it's Professor Williams, and we're going to look at binomial distributions on Minitab. We're going to see how to solve for the probability that x is greater than a given value. Alright, so a recent survey by the Knights of the Roundtable found that despite rumors to the contrary, only 40% of dragons can breathe fire. So in order to determine the size of their fire brigade, the Knights very carefully took a random sample of 20 dragons. Now I want to know, what's the probability that more than 11 dragons in the sample can breathe fire? So we have the hallmarks of a binomial distribution here. We know that 40% of dragons breathe fire, and so the other outcome, 60% chance that they don't. We took a sample of 20, so that's our number of trials is 20. And now I want to know, what's the probability that more than 11 Right, can breathe fire, so this is really found as the probability that x is greater than 11. So let's use this CDF in Minitab to make this work. Alright, so here I am in Minitab, and before I get too far, I need to figure out what my input constant is going to be when I go up here and get this um, binomial distribution. Right? So I wanted to know the probability that more than 11 in my sample breathed fire. So let's think of this as our experiment would have given us between 0 and 20 successes. And now, right here, we'll say I have 11. So I want the probability of more than 11. So what I'm really looking for is the probability from 12 up to 20 cumulatively. Now, the CDF in Minitab will solve for the probability that x is less than or equal to some value. So I'm going in the opposite direction of this function in Minitab. But what I know is that the probability from 0 to 11 plus the probability of 12 to 20 has to equal 1. So this probability plus this probability is going to equal 1. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to let Minitab solve for what it does best, which is this area to the left. I'm going to put in an input constant of 11. I'm going to find this probability here. I'm going to subtract it from 1, and it's going to give me what I want. So input constant is 11 because I wanted greater than 11, so I don't want to include it. So I'm basically solving for what I don't want and then subtracting it from 1 to get what I do want. So up here at calc, I pick probability distribution and I pick binomial. So I'm looking at cumulative right? and number of trials was 20. 40% that we were breathing fire. Right? I looked at my input constant. Remember I wanted more than 11 so I'm going to solve for 11 down to 0, subtract it from 1. So input constant is 11, and I hit OK. So what Minitab has told me is that the probability of 11 or fewer is 0.943474. So I'm simply going to take 1 minus that point nine four three four seven four which is going to give me the probability from 12 to 20 and I'm going to end up with point oh five six five two six and I'm just going to round that off and I'm going to say that I've got about a five point six five percent probability right? that in my sample, more than 11 dragons can breathe fire. Remember, I just simply solved for what I didn't want and then subtracted that from 1 to find what I did want. So as always, I hope that you found this useful, and thanks so much for watching.